Without me, eyes are marbles. No darkness they see. Faces look garbled. No flurry they feel. No breath, no cheer. Death not to fear. Time is not spent. Roses has no scent. At nothing you can marvel without me. But it wasn't roses, my precious. Not roses. Lilies. Not lilies. Not roses. Which one was it, precious? Someone's coming. A man with a stick and a hat and a cage upon his back. We may provide you with a car. There is no hope for him, I fear. The creature is lost. Well, let's see how he responds to some light. Someone tortured him. Long before the Dunadan found him. The darkness grows beyond our borders. My people are growing anxious. We cannot let this evil linger among us. Enough. We believe that he went to Mordor. That's what I feared. What did he hope to find, I wonder? Believe us. I want to hear what he has to say. Very well. Let us try someone else's name. Bilbo Baggins. Yes, you remember him. He found you. More than 60 years ago, deep underneath the roots of the Misty Mountains. He took something from you. Thief! A ring. My precious. You were looking for it. Aren't you? you left your home in the mountains, worming your way down the hills, always hiding from the moon. You followed the hobbit's trace all the way east to the lonely mountain. But then you stopped and turned south. Why? <laughs> Something must have drawn you away. A voice calling you to the land of shadow. Leave us alone! Whispering your name in your dreams. Not listening! So, once again, what is your name? Very well, Smeagol. Now, let us start at the beginning.
up and up again. The Mountains of Shadow. That is where you are hiding. You mustn't ask. Why is it asking us questions? Why? You know why. Long gone. When we came, the nasty orc. Long dead. No nice friend was he precious. <laughs> Not tricking us now, is he? Hmm? No. No. Not anymore. It came to me on my birthday. <laughs> so I've heard. Ox couldn't see us. No one could see us. Not even nasty wizards. How did you find it? You're precious. <laughs> nasty light! <laughs> Smeagol wants to sleep. He cannot sleep now. But I shall dim the light for you. <laughs> You must have had friends once. A family? They kicked us, cast us out, cast them all, cast them. It was our birthday. Yes, it was. So you never left that cave? Never. And no one ever saw you? No one. Uh, 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 
will tell the wraiths and squeal on us. And that's how far you ever went into Mordor. We never, never left the clouds. Why is it asking us? <laughs> there it is, the spy. Two of them. Two little cloaks. <laughs> All they says, all lands and mountains, it might see bains. Mm, not him, not him. Don't speak to him. Don't listen. Them. Follow, but quiet. 
mustn't lose them. Follow, but quiet. Stay in the shadows. What about the bird? Forget birds. I'm telling you, it was that little one. She lost spider friend. I haven't seen it for years. I hope the ladyship had sucked it dry. Yeah, shouldn't report it. it... Then they send their blood out, and that's never fun. Caught you, yeah. Then why are there Stay torture marks to on your hands? Huh. <sighs> she could help us. Something's brewing. Even the shriekers are out and flying. Those screams you make your skin crawl. Yes, the spider could help. First, lure them into her webs, and then... Whoa, that's what's brewing. Fox eye up are getting tense. us no harm, does it? Could be a spy. It could be. Beetle just wants to eat pollen, perhaps. Hmm. Pollen. Hmm. Yes. 
It hasn't been following us, has it? It likes us. Look. Look. Look at me! They brought you to him, didn't they? The Dark Lord. What did you tell him? What did you tell Sauron? Nazk. The ring. Nazk. What did you tell him? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, we swear. We swear. Nask. Nask. Don't tell them, precious. Baggins took it. Baggins from the Shire. So 
who knows? <laughs> 